Hello and welcome to everybody on Cloud Fitness. So in today's video, we are going to see how we can materialize models as tables instead of views. So in the project that we have been working on till now in my DBT series, we have created and we have run our staging model in DBT project, right? So the output of that staging model is actually stored as a view in BigQuery. So right now we are going to see how we can actually materialize it as a table instead of a view. So before moving ahead, I do recommend all of you guys to connect with me on LinkedIn and do remember to like, share and subscribe my channel as well. So when we talk about materializing, right, if you go back, this is our BigQuery project, right, that we have created DBT My Project 1. So you must be following my previous videos. I do recommend following all my videos sequentially, especially the DBT 1 a dbt uh, playlist because we are following all the topics in a proper sequence so this is the uh, you know the dbt my project one the one which we have created and inside it you can see that we have stage e-commerce order so this is the sql model that we have run this is our staging model that we have run and if i click on that you can actually see that if i go to details over here it says view id so actually it is nothing but it is a view now instead of a view what can we actually do to make it as a table right now even if you see the symbol over here it is a view now if i go back to my project that i have created you can actually go to dbt a project.yaml file this is the dbt project.yaml file which contains the details about your projects the paths to your models and you know uh, your macros everything this we have already discussed in our previous videos as well so i'm not going to repeat that but in the dbt project.yaml file what you can actually do is you can simply put these four lines when i say these four lines what it is actually doing it is saying to the dbt project that hey go to the models in the my project one because this is our project that we have in my project one go to models and there keep all the whatever you are writing write everything as a materialized table now this plus symbol is nothing but it means everything right it is not a particular syntax or a format it is just a configuration to tell that hey write everything as a materialized table now this type of setting can be done at each at each individual model level as well but right now what we are going to do is i'm going to do it at a project level where everything we write actually is written as a table right so now if i have written these uh, you can also try it side by side i just save my project and then i what i'll do i'll simply run and i will say dbt run minus s which is nothing but your select stage e-commerce order and i'll just hit enter so you have been knowing this command already so now you can see it has started to run now we will see how exactly the output looks like it says you can also see that it says found three models so basically we have three models seven tests seven sources so it tells you the details about your project now it has started executing and now you can see that it says created table right so now it has actually created a table dbt my project one dot stage e-commerce orders right using this particular model it has created now if i go back right and if i try to refresh the contents over here let me try to refresh the contents over here and see how my table has been created now if i open the open this dbt my project one let me just simply close this and you can actually see that instead of view it has formatted it as stage e-commerce you can actually see the symbol itself has changed now instead of a view the symbol is itself of a table and if you go to details it says table id so this is exactly that i wanted to show you guys that how your models can actually give you the output as a table or as a view and how you can change it but remember that you know here we have added it as a project level if you want you can actually add it as each individual model level as well we will do that later on right so this is exactly how you do that so i hope you like this particular video it gave you know a meaning to you uh, it gave a lot of information to you on the dbt so i hope you like this video and thank you so much for being till here and always do remember to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for being till here.